Welcome people, it's Mike here, and I've come to show you an unboxing of Scars of Mirrodin. Well, let's, uh, let's get it open and everything. Turn me too hard. Just gotta let open my tool. Let's get this open. Got this for Christmas. And I'm glad for it. It's a new sealed box. $200 or something like that, I don't know. So nice. Ooh. Oh. Got the little thing. I don't know, is it a pamphlet I guess? Or a flyer. Ooh. And these packs the the packs are cool. I don't know if you'd see that. Otherwise it's glare. that box up here. Alright. So the way I uh, do my cards is I put them to the respective people on them. So I will quickly do that and I'll be right back. Alright, so I've piled them all up. I think we're going to go with the most, which is the Elspeth pile. I have one more than every other uh, for the five. Is we got these, we have five people. And there's only, what was it? Eight, or seven in each, and then eight in this one. Let's start it up. Let's see if the Elspeth's uh, pile has anything relatively good. Maybe an Elspeth. That'd be nice if I could open this up. I'm kind of really bad at opening. Yeah, I just dropped a few. <laughs> I'm just going through this pack only once, and then I'll go through to the rare every other time. I'm just showing you what it could be, and what all the other cards are. Oh, True Conviction. It's not bad. I think we also have a foil on this one. Yeah, we do. Corrupted Harvester. It's not bad. Let's put that off to the side. Let's get those out. Infiltration lens. Riddle Smith. Pain Smith. And then Etch Champion. Yeah. That's a good one. I like that. Alright. And then Mountain and a Soldier. Next, Elf Stuff. I'll just go through the entire Elf Stuff uh, packs and then I'll go to another one. Life Smith. Rooming Bird, Barrage Ogre, and Contagion Engine. That's not bad. That's really good. I like that. I could use it for my Infect. A Mountain and a Wolf Token. Alright. That's not bad for a good start. I don't even know what I just said, actually. <laughs> That's not bad for a good start. Alright. Clone Shell. Flesh Allergy. Mirror Smith. The rare is Mirror. Propagator. Well, so that's what it's called. And then a Forest and a Mirror. Wow, that's a lot of Mirrors in that one pack. A mirror Smith. A mirror Propagator. How many other things than Mirror? Uh, we got Copper Mirror as well. Origin Spellbomb. Like a whole mirror army in this. 
Let's see. Okay. Bloodshot Trainee. Golem's Heart. Carrion Call. Oh my. I like the fact that it's in an Elspeth pack, too. Which makes it even better. <laughs> oh my god. I think that, I don't even know how much this is. That's that's amazing. That's that's great A. Eh? Amazing. We got a mountain, a mirror, and a foil. Ooh. Well I don't even know how to say this, but Willishan Reigns. I, I use this card actually. It's really nice. I'm glad that we got the Elspeth. Oh my god. I was expecting at least something. I already have a Venser and a Koth from the uh, dual decks, which I would have made a video on, but it I don't think there'd be much worth in that. I'm just trying to get to the thing. Okay, Lifesmith, Thrumming Bird, Glimmer Point C Stag, and the Grand Architect. It's not that bad. I like it, I like it. And we got a Forest and a Wolf Token. Oops, sorry. Didn't mean to move the camera on you. Ah, Alright. Let's get this out of the way. Trigon of Thought. Palladium Mirror. Ogre Gear Grabber. Ooh, and a Copper Line Gorge. Quality card. Could use that, maybe sell it. I don't know. And a Mirror Token and a uh, Mountain. I may just end up selling most of the stuff or leaving it up for trade for my friends. It really depends on my feeling for it. Okay, Trigon of Thought. Arc Trial. Halt Order. And then Spike Shot Elder. I think we have also a foil on this one. Mountain, a mere token. And the Volshock Heart Sto Stoker. Yeah. So that's right now two foil uncommons and one foil common. And one mythic. And a bunch of other rips. That was just from the Elspeth. I like it. I think the Elspeth is a good one. Definitely a good one. Let's go to. Let's go to the next Planeswalkers. Which will be. Koth. The first Planeswalker that I ever got was Koth, and he was a foil, and I think I ended up trading him away when I was, like, really young, though, which was, like, when I was 10, maybe less. I didn't realize how great he was. I was like, oh, this is my first guy. Thrumming Bird, Necropede, Rusted Relic. And Genesis Wave, ooh, yes. Already liking this, these packs. And Planes and the Golem. <laughs> yeah. So hopefully, we can get Koth from the Koth pack. That'd be pretty nice. Liquid Metal Coating, Garage Ogre, Bellowing Tangle Worm, a nice card. And a Razor Verge Stick It. Ooh, that's that's a really nice card. A Forest and a Poison Counter. I like, I like. So only one Mythic so far from, I don't know how many packs. This is there eight, eight, seven, there's five here. So about ten packs in and only one Mythic. I'm not surprised by that, actually. That's some really decent cards. Viridian Revel, Heavy Erebolus, I don't know how to say that, Darksteel Sentinel, and then Molten Psyche, Planes, and a Rolls, 
card for imprint. <laughs> All right. I just put down the rare actually. There we go. It, the rare is so in insignificant to me. Because I'd, I'd never seen it before. Alright, next pack. <sighs> Trigon of Rage. Life Smith. Carrion Call. And then a uh, Chimeric Mass. The forest and uh, another rules tip guide. So if you want to learn the rules, get the cloth packs. Good luck getting any of these packs, actually. I don't know if it's worth two hundred dollars the booster box, but like, I guess in a sense it would be. Dark Seal Axe, Flush Allergy, Contagion Clasp. Uh, Cynicism, that's nice, that's really nice. Genesis Wave and a Cynicism in the cough packs, that's not bad. Forest and a Soldier Token. Okay, let's see, we got two more cough packs left. So, might as well try to knock them out and then we can go into Venser. Uh, let's get them away. Let's see, okay. Let's make sure that this is okay. Arioch Edge Right, Necropede, Ogre Gear Grabber, and a Mox o Mox Opal, are you kidding me, mate? This is. Oh my gosh. And we have a foil. I think so. I think we have a foil with a forest rules tip and a vector asp. Wow, that's not bad. Both mythic packs had a foil in it. That's really nice. I kind of like that, but Mox Opal, come on, mate. It's like a $40 card. Oh, baby. More to gain money. So, that's pretty nice. Cough packs give you Mox Opals and Elspeths give you Elspeths. Let's see. Okay. Slice and Twain. Grafted Exoskeleton. Corrupted Harvester. And a Mere Battle Sphere. This over here. Okay. Yeah. Check this out. We got this $40 card, Bob. Yeah. Mark's got four. Yeah. Time to go on Venser. See what this planeswalker gets me. With Koth it gets Koth gets me Mox Opals. Elspeths get me Elspeths. <sighs> and yeah. Didn't expect that. I didn't expect to get a Mox Opal from this. I totally forgot that there was actually in here. I thought they were more rare. They are, sort of. Alright. Arioch Edgerite. Trigon and Infestation. Trigon Mending, uh, Sun Semblance Anvil. And this planes and an insect token. Wow, they really want to know about that planes. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, yeah, they do. Okay. I'm also dying. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, I think we have also a foil. Okay, Acid Web Spider, Grafted Exoskeleton, another Mirror Smith, and Azuri. Not bad, not bad. And do we have a foil? No, it's just the Goblin. I saw a red. I was like, oh, we must have a red foil. I was like, that'd be nice. Maybe a cough. Cough foil again? Oh my god, that'd be great. The second one in my lifetime. Get these out of the way. Golem's Heart. Dark Steel S Sentinel. Coin. Dias. 
Augmentum Armor. That's actually really nice. I was reading up on this card. And it's really nice. It's an equipped creature. It gets plus six, plus six. For equip six, and you have to cast it for six. And whenever an equipped creature attacks, destroy target permanent, which is really nice. I I really like that. I'm, I might use that. And uh, Poison Counter and Island. Right. So far we're, I think we're like three packs in. And not much, really. We've only gotten not really that much from this. I think there's a foil in this one. Hopefully there's also a Mythic. So Acid Web Spider, Liquid Metal Coating, Gling Dias. Oh, and we do have a mythic. I I knew it. It's a Legion of the Tangle. Legion of the Tangle. I love this card. This is a great card. I love it. So that's a good way to tell if... Uh, poison Cannon. Oh, we don't have a foil. Well, I'd rather... I don't care, really. I'm just glad that I got three mythics so far. So Ventures give you... Legion of the Tangle. Interesting. Let's, let's get this all out. Oh, I, uh, we got a golden urn. That's not bad. I like that. Razor Hippogriff. Bard Battle Gear. I like that. Mirror Galvanizer. I like that too. And Stratoscythe, which I think is pretty good. I don't I don't know much about it. Oh, and a Psychic Miasma. Foil. That's not bad. I like it. Could be worse. Oh, my cat's here. Hello, kitty. I think I'm going to get a uh, mythic from each character. Right. Let's see. Twisted Image. Trigon of Corruption. Throne of Geth. And Tempered Steel. Oh, we have a foil on this one. Planes. Cat Token. Oh, and our foil rare is an exor... Inexorable Tide, I believe that's how you say it. It's not a bad card. I like that card. It works out very well for any type of proliferate deck or impact deck or any other counters. It, it works very nicely, and I actually wanted one of those. So I'm thinking about making a uh, proliferate deck. Right. Necrogen, Scuddler, Glimmer Post Skag, Stag, Throne of Geth, and Nim Death Mantle. That's not a bad card. I like that. I like that card. That'd be a nice card for a zombie deck. Alright, now we're on to. Let's go to our. I believe our, it was our first rare? Was it our first rare? No, our second rare. The Edge Champion. So, Ventsor gives you foil rares and the Lead to the Tangle. Alright. Let's see what Edge Champion gives us. Furnace Celebration, Memnite, Ember Smith. And a Horde Smelter Dragon. I remember this card. I used to have one of these back in like the intro packs. <laughs> these things were really weird looking. I think we also have a foil. Swamp. Rule Sheet. Oh, and a foil leather mirror. I like that. That looks very nice. That's not bad. I like that. I'm not disappointed with that pack. Definitely uh, snap pick that mirror. Instead of the dragon. The dragon is not really that good for me, I guess. Maybe it would be. It really depends on what deck I'm playing. If I was trying to go a mirror deck, definitely pick the mirror. If I was trying to do an artifact deck, which I think most people would, they'd pick that first hand or something else, like a common. The Trigon of Rage. Vigil of the Lost. Riddle Smith. The Tower of Calamities. Oh, this card's crazy. I. It's for 8 mana, and you also tap, tap 8, tap it, and then it, it deals full damage to target creature. 
It's not bad. My uncle, it would sound back so much, but it, he'd end up winning by it. This is when I was like really young. Don't, don't judge me now. Okay. Okay. Bard Battle Gear. Abuna Acolyte. Contagion Clasp. And a Pure Defects. This card too. I remember having an Infect deck with this card in. I think this was one of the uh, intro packs as well. I don't know really. I don't remember. I don't remember those sets very much. Since so old is back in like 2010. So it that was a while ago. This is right now it's close to being 2016. If not it's already 2016 when you're already seeing this. Because I doubt it'll be anything earlier. Okay. Exanguate, I think. I don't know what this is. Exanguate, yeah. Arc trial. Incorats. Tunnel Ignis. Mountain and a loose card. Alright. These packs up. Just throw these empty things on the floor. Okay. Necrotics, Necrogen, Scuddler, Infiltration Lens, Trinket Mage, and a Carnifex Demon. I think, was this also? I think that was also the uh, intro pack. And a Swamp and a Little Step card. So far we have two packs left. Hopefully we can get a Mythic out of this one as well. Uh, maybe like a Worm Coil Engine. That'd be nice. Or cough or events are I don't mind really much for both of those but worm coil engine would do me nice right. from the celebration this dispense justice painsmith and a black leaf cliffs a mountain and a soldier I'm glad I got at least three of these types of cards because I might as well just sell those. I'm really not going to use them. Maybe use them for like a commander deck. Which I got all the... I think it was... The 2013 commander decks where it had Uluru. Or I don't know how to say his name, but it's like Uluru. I don't know. I don't know. Don't, don't judge me. I don't know how to pronounce their names. But I got those. And I got all five, I believe. I think there's only five. I didn't want to make a video on them because there would be no point. I didn't open packs, which made much surprise. I could have done videos, but it really wouldn't matter. I really wanted to open them. I didn't want to wait. So the last pack, a Vets Champion. Toss it on the floor. Accentuate. Abuna Acolyte. Trigon Amending. That's Hope. Can we get a Mythic out of this one, too? Oh, we do get... Mm, baby Geth yeah boy look at that mm. that's greatness right there that's mm. I don't think he's worth that much but he's at least it's a mythic come on that's four mythics already an insect and a mountain insignificant but other point man that's really nice so that's champions give you Geths it's not bad I'm not, I'm not complaining about it I just there seems to be a lot of zombie things. I probably could trade that to my friend who runs a zombie deck. He'd probably like it. Okay, now we're on the Imperium. I think that's what it is. I don't, I don't know exactly which card this is. Paladium. No. Paladium Imperium, I think. I think that's called. Okay. Okay, Vigil for the Lost, Dark Steel Mirror, Halt Order, and a Dark Steel Juggernaut, a Goblin and a Swamp Token, or, I just said that, uh, a Swamp and a Goblin Token, I want a, I want a Swamp Token. Next pack.
Volition Reigns. Second one. Uh, Golem Artisan. Dark Steel Mirror. And Shape Anew. It's pretty nice. I haven't seen that card in a long time. I know I'm going to get judged so hard for uh, not reading off the cards, but I don't mind. I'm just trying to get this video done as fast as possible. I think it's actually been like five minutes, really. Jeez, that's really weird. Or, wait, maybe it was like 25, I don't know. My camera stops at like 20 and then restarts. Alright. Oxida. Scrap Melter. Viridian Revel. Tangle Angler. Oh, I could use that for an infect deck. And then a Ratchet Bomb. That's not bad. I like that. Take that for any day. Oh, well, except... Nah, I might as well take it. It's not a bad card. I I definitely would take it first pick in a draft. First pack, first pick. Bloodshot Trainee. Dark Slick Drake. Paladin Mirror. A Sea Chrome Coast. That's not bad. I like that. That's our fourth one of those. Fourth one of those kinds. Definitely have one of those. I'm gonna like... <coughs> There we go. Okay. So, here we go. Lumen Grid. Drake is our common. I just, I don't know. I just said the name for some reason. Ooh, it's still a rebuttal. That's not bad. Okay. Twisted Image. Following Tangle Worm. Mirror Galvanizer. The Steel Hellkite. Yeah, this, this was a very interesting card. I didn't know it was always paired with some blue artificer, I think. I think that's what it was. Yeah. Yeah, it was. I, I don't remember the name, though. So we're on to our second pack. Hopefully we can get another Mythic. Even though we already have four, but I want, I want a fifth one now. Because... Who doesn't want a fifth one? Who doesn't want Mythics? Mythics for days. Trigon and Infestation. Dark Slick Drake. Rust stick, a sunblast angel, and no foil so far for this one. Maybe it's gonna be in here with the mythic. So in our last pack for Squadron Mirror then Booster Box. And doesn't look too good. I got a quick glance by accident on the, if there was a foil and I don't think there is. Heavy Arbalist, Crocodile Harvester. Rustic, please baby. Ah, oh, Argumentum Armor. It's not bad. Really wish I had another uh, Mythic. The four Mythics is fine. Definitely got a good amount of my money's worth. Let's see. Okay. So let's just separate these. I'll pause the video right now. So I have them all sorted out. We've got our four uh, dual lands. We have our reds, our greens, one black, three white, two blue, our foils, and then a ton of artifact cards. And then we have our mighty fine uh, mythics like Elspeth, Mox Opal, Leads of the Tangle, and Geth. I think I definitely got at least a good amount of my money's worth back. It shouldn't be too much. Like, I definitely like it. I think Mox Opal's 40. Elspeth's 20-ish. I think 15. Something around there. I don't know. And these are varied between, like, 5 to $15, I think. Yeah, it's not too bad. All right, well, uh... Thanks for watching. Leave a like on the video. Leave a comment if you wish to do so. Tell us what you want us to record. And we'll do it for you. We'll, we'll try to do it for you. Not More like Magic Base or games. Any such thing like that. I know we're... I definitely got... Uh, what is it? Arena of the Planeswalkers. So I'm going to try to get them... Try to get some people to play that. 
We're doing uh, some booster pack battles where instead we could do both of these ideas. Booster pack battles as in we each get a booster pack, we open it up, whoever wins gets to keep all the packs. But since it, we're not actually, we aren't funding it, we don't really care. But if it if we were funding it, then, then it wouldn't matter. Um, or we could do booster pack battles as in we each get a booster pack and we each battle to see who would win. And then I think the winner would get another booster pack or something like that. So, and also just remember to uh, check out manaleak.com, our sponsor. They're pretty nice. Um, I'll just probably ask my uh, editor to put in a little title right now of their logo and everything. Or maybe at the beginning of the video or the outro. I don't know. Something like that. But yeah, thanks for checking out the video. Have a good day. Peace out. Remember, let's play some games.